what is going on guys long time no see um we're back kind of kind of we're back um you know i've i've been busy so i got to um i got to say that i've been busy you know um kind of uh, but I would like to apologize, you know, I I started this whole thing to like document like What you could expect if you're going through something similar at a similar age and lifestyle choices um, And you know, I've let you guys down, but um, I've had some Exciting not so exciting stuff going on um, so, let's, uh, let's get into what's been going on. Um, so I think it's been, like, almost three weeks, two weeks, uh, since I've, like, done anything. Uh, you know. Oh, excuse me. It's, um, been raining the past couple of days, so I've had no motivation to do anything. You know, I was supposed to, I recorded a bunch of stuff, but I just never got around to posting it. Um, and I want to say I'm sorry for that. But, um, yeah, let's get into what's been going on. So, we're going to start off, well, well, disclaimer, I'm taking my shirt off, but you guys are used to that. Um, so... Whoa, you might notice something, actually, let's see, let's see if, can you guys see that? I don't know if you guys can really see all the bruising and just not fun stuff going on over here. Um, I was given a nice little blood clot, you know? Um, so mine, so my port is here, you know, um, this is where my heart is, and I have a blood clot somewhere in one of, near this heart. Um, so what I've been doing is I've been dealing with that. Um, and, you know, it's been, it's been a journey so far. You know, the, the swelling and stuff has started to go down. Like, you can't really tell before. Um, let's turn this back off. Uh, put my shirt back on. Um, it's been tough, guys. I haven't... I haven't worked out in... I don't... Honestly, since the last time I was uploading videos, pretty much. I just woke up one day and my arm was fully like pumped. So I don't, as as like a lifter, that's the only way I can explain it. It was just like full of blood, blood like was not leaving. And yeah, long story short, this whole arm just got, you know, destroyed pretty much. So I've been dealing with that. Um, I take Lovanox. It is a twice a day shot yeah so you guys might see if you can see it you can see a little bruising um i do my belly and both my legs um and it's it's just twice a day um so i just inject myself i'd show you guys but uh, i don't know if like that's a lot kind of stuff's allowed um but yeah, so now I do that every day. Um, cycle four is over, by the way. I don't, you know, I'm that being Christine messes me up, guys. I tell you, um, that's another reason I I was admitted to inpatient last weekend. Um, and I stayed in the hospital for like two days, two nights, two days, something like that. You know, it was, it was my Friday, you know, I was all 
amped up because it was my last like chemo day um and it's short you know it's you're in and you're out in an hour on fridays for my cycle um and and i get to go home and be happy but no 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 of course what why would i why would i be allowed that come on um but no i mean i've been you know it sucks you know i, I lost like the ability to do something that i really like to do um and you know i could lift but they said that puts me at risk for the clot moving and you don't want um a blood clot to move um i i say it's like the blood clots by my heart which sounds like scary but apparently it's like not as scary uh you don't want it to move to your lungs or your brain um because you know brain that's that's a stroke lungs i i mean you use those to breathe you know so uh yeah but i haven't been doing that i haven't been doing any cardio i've just been you know wasting my life away in this room um and just been grinding on like mental health because it's hard guys you know it's you know, I see all my friends at school and they're having a blast and, you know, my life's kind of on pause and, um, I had the gym and I was making progress, you know, which I thought was something I wouldn't be able to do. So seeing like that little amount of progress, I uh, was awesome. And now it's kind of like it got taken away and it's that same feeling when I first got cancer, like that uh just everything and everyone was against you and uh that took a few days to like get over get over myself and realize like you know shit keeps going you know i mean um you know just being grateful i i said in my previous videos um and i'm grateful you know i've had um just a lot of stuff going on recently like i've had stupid people from my past coming up and doing stupid things um shout out you you guys um just stupid my my own body doing stupid stuff it's just like I, you know i read it everywhere and it's so it's time and time again where it's like these people i guess even me you know like that get cancer or have something horrible happen to them um it's it's just like everything comes on at once you know and that that's been kind of the case but um you know looking back at it you know just a slight reflection from a few days ago uh it's gonna make me a lot better you know in the future um whatever um that given amount of time I have is I will be a lot stronger mentally physically and um emotionally I think um you know I've seen a lot of stuff with um no never mind. don't worry about that um but yeah so I've been dealing with the blood clot uh cycle four the vin Christine, uh you know feels like I'm dying after you know the first first two two or three days um oh sorry first two or three days goodness you know i'll tell you i'll tell you what you want i mean per i don't know about everyone out there but for me um uh, yeah you feel like you're dying I, there's no real way around that there's no other way to put that um it's the like i just get anxious i just get i get like a cough i get everything hurts my no matter how much i drink i don't feel like hydrated gatorade water just straight water and salt i mean it doesn't 
like bathroom stool problems, you know. Like the only real time Vin Christine like f it feels fine is like a nice shower. Um, that's like the only time it feels okay. Um, and, you know, a shower is only like 15 minutes if you're pushing it. That's for me, at least. I can't just sit there in the shower for... On Vin Christine, I can, I'll be honest. I, I just throw some music on and I just close my eyes and pretty much just kneel down in that shower and just, just sit there, you know. Um... But yeah, so I've been dealing with that. That's where I've been. That's my update. But tomorrow is Monday. I have to go back in uh, to clinic. Sorry. To clinic. I'm getting uh, two sets of blood work done. I'm getting one through my port and then one through my IV. Um... So they think the port is the main reason for the clot. Um, they don't, they like, they don't know, but they like know, you know? Cause like, I'm not, I mean, other than like the chemo, I'm at like no risk for clotting. Um, now I am. Shout out the blood clot. Now I'm at way higher risk for blood clots in the future and stuff I think I don't know they might have told me that um you know once the port's gone I, I'll probably be at that same like low risk but who knows you know all this stuff is not there's so little we know about all this um and you know that's my goal just document this so you know even if i'm not around I, my story can still be out there and people can learn and do better you know um, like they see all the shit i eat and be like oh maybe i shouldn't do that yeah maybe you shouldn't you know um but yeah um so that's where i've been uh that's what i've been up to and not much else to talk about i i'll start doing these again um, I've wanted to do it, but I've had nothing to, like, nothing to share. I mean, I feel like all the stuff that's been going on has been so, like, not good, you know, like, bad. And it's like, I don't want to put that kind of energy out there, you know? I mean, it's, it's like the, tr the hard reality of the whole cancer thing is like this, this is just how it is for a lot of people. Uh, myself included and you know it's not I don't like to show that I guess you know because it doesn't it doesn't have to be like I told you guys I I might not have been posting for like two weeks but I've been like I haven't been like depressed the whole time you know it's been like two days you know I two days I'm just like ugh and then I just like sleep all day and then I feel fine again you know um but don't worry about what i'm going through you know i i've got it all under control now um that's what i wanted to do before i just spout stuff at you guys um but going forward for me i believe the 11th of next month is my last day of chemo hopefully forever done and then once it's once that's done i i'm a survivor i guess you know um and then it's scans after that i i'll get into all that in another video um but yeah that's my life update um i hope everything is going well with you guys uh it's been a rainy couple of days here in the old state of maryland um but you know what can you do uh that's just how it is i hope you guys are doing well i hope everything's going well with you guys and you guys are making the most of what you are given um keep killing it guys and i will talk to you 
hopefully soon. Peace out, guys.